Well, the day is finally here. The moment you've all been waiting for. We're off today to pick up our puppy. So this is gonna be a really busy and long day for us. I think what I'll do is divide this into two videos, actually. First, I, I know that everybody's anxious to see what puppy we pick. And secondly, uh, I know that there'll be some people interested in knowing how we introduce our puppy to our existing dog, Brew. So yeah, I think we'll break this up into two videos. I feel like we should be singing on the road again. We've been on the road so much lately. Mama's got to go in and get some money. Puppies ain't free. Yeah. I want to come. Nope. Huh. Okay. I should have found it actually when I... You got the dough? We're on the open road again. So yeah, the moment we've all been waiting for. This has actually been a long time coming. A lot of prep and work has gone into this day. We were just talking and thought it might be good for you guys to know kind of the process behind how we got to this day, such as how we first discovered what breeder we would get our puppy from and what we were looking for in a breeder uh, so that we knew that we were getting a good quality puppy. And actually getting a puppy. Or actually getting a puppy, yeah, so that we weren't getting scammed. We contacted a breeder and they were a scam, scammer, right? And uh, luckily, luckily we identified early in the process that this person was a scammer and uh, actually reported them to the website that they were on uh, and that they were advertising on. The kinds of things that uh, you should be looking for if you're looking for a puppy, uh, it's important to know that a breeder will often want to be involved in the process from start to, start to finish. So for example, we've done a phone call with this breeder and she asked us a whole bunch of questions to make sure that we were suitable pet owners, basically. And she asked for a reference as well. Yep, she asked for references, so we gave our vet as a reference. She asked a lot of uh, questions about... About our family, about about Gru, um, just about just about us, about what kind of life the puppy would have things like that. She's, she's very invested in making sure that puppies have a good life, which I really like. Yeah, she's even gone so far as to say that uh, if the people that purchase her puppies no longer wish to have the puppy, that she wants them to return the puppy to her so that she can rehome the puppy rather than they rehoming the puppy themselves, right? She's really interested in knowing that the, the puppy has a good life. Babies. Another good way to kind of vet out the scammers is to make sure that the breeder is willing to have you visit the puppies so that you can come and see the, the, the parents, the mom, yeah, and uh, to see the rest of the litter and kind of like what we did. And if you haven't seen that video, I'll include a link right here for you to see that video. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> What? It's gonna be right here, right here? on their screen. <laughs> uh. Oh, I just cried a little bit. <laughs> What else should people be looking for, Mama? If somebody is pushing you to pay a deposit before you at least talk to them on the don't do it. And even seeing the puppies first is a good idea. One of the things that uh, legitimate breeders do, and we're fully expecting to have to do this today, is that they often have a contract uh, for the buyers to sign. The contract has a lot of just common sense stuff in it. We have the contract, it was sent over to us uh, prior to today. So we've been able to review it, um, which is probably a good thing to do before you actually sign it. It includes things like, you know, when we're going to spay or neuter the puppy, what kind of veterinary care we are supposed to provide the puppy, uh, nutritional care that we're supposed to give to the puppy. Basically, all things that we have we have done for Brew yeah. that we were that we'd already do, but it's the contract is to make sure that the puppies are going to a good home and they're going to be cared for. Our, our breeder has also asked us to bring along some photo identification uh, so that she knows who we are, that we're actual people, right? So all these things that we've talked about are important to take into consideration 
It's important for you as the buyer to be cautious so you don't get scammed. These things are also important so that the best interests of the puppy are taken into consideration as well. So enough of that. Now for the fun stuff. We uh, came prepared today to do everything we can to make sure that soon to be Rosalina is as comfortable as she can be. So we brought along with us a few things that we picked up recently. Let's see, what do we get? What's first? Don't know if this will fit her though. So we got a harness, so we can take her for walks. We're not sure if it'll fit her. She's still pretty small, so we'll see. We'll see if that one fits her. But if that doesn't fit her, we have a collar. And on the collar, it has her name on it, on, on a tag that we got engraved. So that should fit her, if the harness doesn't. And then we also brought along the leash, a pretty pink leash to treat. Oh yeah, you gotta have treats. So we'll be doing a lot of training in the next month <laughs> or more probably. Lots of training. So treats are a necessity. And of course, poo bags. Always poop and scoop. What else you got there? Got a monkey The Kai picked out. So we got a stuffy that looks like a monkey. So, you know. And a blanket. So stuff for her to cuddle in and get cozy and get comfy. Mom, can you get a big blanket. Oh, it's not in here. One of the things that we learned from Brew is that above all other things, Brew loves his blankie. So we had to bring a blankie for Rosalina. Absolutely. If you'd like to see Rosalina's adventures, it might be a good idea to subscribe. We're also going to do a video in the near future of uh, how we introduce her today to Brew, uh, so keep an eye out for that one. If you've liked this video, please give us a thumbs up. <laughs> Look at this 